Go Bearcats TV here with head coach Hilton Days following a 3-2 victory for the men's soccer team. And coach, the last two years you've played NKU have ended in 1-1 draws. What did it mean for your team to come out and get a result here tonight? Well, I think this was a great night for us. It was a great night for all Bearcats, you know. Northern Kentucky is, is, is a very tough team to beat. They came back from a two-goal deficit. They're very resilient. They play, they, they, they compete really well. So we knew even that 2-0, the game wasn't over. We needed to continue playing, and if we could get a third goal, maybe that would give us a little bit more breathing room. But for us, it's a huge win because the last couple of years, we've opened with NKU and we've opened with draws, uh, ties. So we haven't been able to beat them in a number of years. So this is a great win for our team, and I'm just so pleased and happy for the guys because we've worked really hard to, uh, you know, to prepare for our season, and it's a great way to start it. And Coach, last season, not quite the season you wanted to have. How important is it for your team to start off with a victory this year? Well, it's it's very important, you know. But we, we talk to our guys about just not focusing, you know, on on the, the win, but focusing on the process and focusing on doing their job, and the and the results will come. And tonight, you know, obviously when NKU tied it up 2-2, our guys could have dropped their heads and stopped playing. Instead, we went out and found a winner. So it's a great way to start our season, and I feel like this team deserve the win tonight and it was just a great way for us to to also um, reward our fans for coming out they saw five goals tonight and coach tonight John Manga not in the starting lineup what did it mean for Alejandro to come out and get those two goals to help the Bearcats win tonight well Alejandro is a very good player and he's a natural forward we've played him wide last year and even this year so we know he can play up top and um, you know he came came up big for us tonight and got two really good goals He's a goal scorer, and for us, it's great to see him get on the scoreboard. And for us, you know, with John out, obviously we need other guys to step up. And tonight, you know, um, Alejandro did. Okay, did you guys play Valparaiso on Monday night? What kind of preparations are you going to be making? Uh, and what did you see that you could build on from tonight's match? Well, I think we can build on just the great uh, chemistry and the great togetherness within our team that had us come, obviously, and got the winner late. Um, first thing we want to do is get a regen going. We want our guys to recover. Tonight was a tough match, and so we play again on Monday. So the first thing for the other business is getting our guys some rest, getting them uh, regenerated, get their legs back. Then we'll obviously look at the tape. And then we'll, uh, we'll, we'll also prepare for, uh, for Valpo. But Monday's a few days away, so we have a 24-hour rule. You, only, you get to celebrate it for 24 hours and then back to work tomorrow. All right, Coach, again, congratulations on the win tonight, and good luck on Monday. Thank you very much. A Go Bearcats TV here with Nick Melvu, who scored the game-winning goal in the 85th minute. And, Nick, just walk us through that play at the end. Um, I just saw an opportunity to get forward. Um, Adam made a good run to check into that pocket. I played into him, and he laid me off a good ball. Um, and then I think I caught the goalkeeper cheating off his line a little bit. I think he thought I was going to maybe go for it and play the ball across. Um, but I looked up and saw an opportunity, so I was able to pick a spot out and put it in. You guys were up 2-0 at one point, and then NKU started to come back. What kind of mentality did you guys have to not give up and ended up winning the match? Well, at halftime, we talked about mental toughness. We knew they were going to come out hard. like. Um, so we just had to stick to our game plan, you know, not change it, but just manage the game well. And obviously uh, they came back, um, tied up the game, but that mental toughness showed up and uh, we were able to finish it out. All right, Nick, congrats again on the goal and congrats on the victory. Good luck on Monday.